This is Jacob Saga 13 here, and today I'm going to be doing some more World Cup predictions. Now, these are, like, my other predictions are still the same, but these predictions are based off of FIFA World Ranking currently. And obviously, the winner is going to be Spain because they're uh, currently first in the world. So, you know. But in between, there's a couple interesting uh, matchups. First off, this is who's going to make it out of the group. Brazil is going to win Group A. Croatia is going to get second. Um, I think I predicted that uh, in my predictions. Uh, I think mine were the same as that. Same for Group B, in which Spain is the winner and Holland is second. And I think the same for Group C as well, with Colombia winning it, winning the group and Greece in second. Now, Group D is different, but it could happen this way with Uruguay beating Italy. Because pretty much any South American team is a home team in this tournament because it's going to be really, really hot. And most European teams will not be used to that at all. Like, there'll be a difference of 30 to 50 degrees. But, uh, like, some teams are training uh, currently in, well, currently or are going to be uh, training in, like, a hotter area to get used to it. But, you know, a lot of teams won't be ready for it. And, so, you, anyways, Uruguay topping Group D with Italy getting second. England still getting knocked out. Um, it's the same as my predictions, just flip the two. Um, the winner and runner-up of the group. And Group E, this one also, the same two teams progress, but this time Switzerland is going to win the group, and France is going to um, get second. France currently 18th, the worst top European nation uh, in this in this, uh, the current rankings in 18th place. Them in England, you know, 15th and 18th. Although the world rankings aren't completely, like, uh, you know, they're not legitimate, sort of, like, it's based on uh, individual matches, and, like, <clears throat> friendlies can count towards it, and, you know, unofficial tournaments like international friendlies, and then stuff like that all counts towards it the World Cup and everything, but, uh, you know, it's not that great of a ranking system, but, um, <clears throat> anyways, on to Group F, and Argentina is going to win that one with Bosnia and Herzegovina getting second, <clears throat> that one's probably the easiest group to get out of, 17th place, 38th place, and 47th place, and then Argentina being third, and then Group G is going to be Germany and Portugal going through Germany winning the group USA getting third and they're actually pretty pretty far up there they're currently um, ahead of France and England in the rankings but whether or not they could beat those either of those two teams on a given day uh, you know, probably not but <clears throat> those are the rankings and then group H it's going to be Belgium going through um, <clears throat> and Russia getting second place in the group. So those are the teams that progress. And I think I have those exact teams going through, but <clears throat> I didn't base any of my predictions off of uh, world ranking, just how they, how well they've been playing. But anyways, on to the round of 16, and those these teams are progressing, the highlighted teams, Brazil versus Holland, Brazil's ninth place to Holland's 10th, that one's probably the closest matchup. Uh, you know, only one point off. But Brazil goes through Colombia versus Italy. Now, this could happen if Italy does get run out of Group D because um, Colombia is basically a home team to Italy. But, anyways, fifth place Colombia to eighth place Italy. Colombia goes through Switzerland. Is pretty high up there right now, sixth place, but they're playing a 17th place team, so they go through. And then Germany, third place, no, second place, well, um, yeah, second to Russia's 22nd. So they go through, and then Spain versus Croatia, Spain is first, obviously, so they're going to go through Uruguay versus Greece, so that's going to be seventh against uh, 12th place, and they'll go through Argentina versus France, Argentina is third, France is 18th. Uh, so they'll get through 
Argentina would probably beat France either way, uh, even not not looking at the rankings. And then Portugal versus Belgium. Uh, Portugal's fourth, Belgium's eleventh. Portugal is going to go through, and then on to the quarterfinals. And Colombia. Now this is where it gets a little bit different. Um, well, sort of. Brazil actually would be knocked out if this were based off of the uh, the FIFA World Rankings, because Colombia is four places ahead of them. So Brazil getting knocked out, which that would probably, like most likely, would not happen in real life. But you know, based on the rankings, that would happen. What's what? That is what would happen. Uh, and then Germany versus Switzerland. Switzerland would be somehow making it into the quarterfinals. Uh, there is a possibility, it's just not very likely, but Germany is four places ahead of them, so they would go through. And then Spain is first place again, so they're going to go through against Uruguay. Then Argentina versus Portugal. Um, Portugal, fourth place. Argentina, third place. So Argentina goes through because they're one ahead. So then on to the semifinals. It's going to be Germany versus Colombia and Spain versus Argentina. Germany wins because they are three places ahead of Colombia. Spain are two places ahead of Argentina. So then in the final, Spain would win against Germany. And then Argentina would get third place, Colombia would get fourth place. So if it were rank, um, like based on world rankings right now, it'd be an all-European final, and then uh, South American third and fourth place teams. Now that could happen, but it's not that likely. Uh, there haven't been that many teams to win the World Cup in uh, South American nation. Um, I think like two or three or something like that. But, you know, it's not very likely. But if someone was going to win it, it would be Spain or Germany. So, those are the predictions based on the uh, FIFA World Rankings currently. So, that'll be the end of the video. Like and subscribe, and I will see you guys later.